Configuring a default build task in VS Code lets you run a build using a simple keyboard shortcut. Now to demonstrate this, here I have a TypeScript project. So I have a TypeScript file here and then a tsconfig. And the first step is that we actually go, need to go and configure the default build task. So I'm going to open up the command palette with Control Shift P or Command Shift P and say configure default build task. So task configure default build task here. And now it is listing off all of the available tasks. If you have gone and manually configured tasks, they would also be listed here. But in this case, it's automatically detected a set of tasks. So it looked at my package JSON file and generated tasks for npm running the npm scripts here, such as npm install or npm test. And then it's also seen that I have a TS config, so it's generated these TSC build tasks here. In this case, I want to uh, have my default task be running TSC build. So let's just go select that. And you can see now that when I selected that, it has actually gone and created a .vs code task file because that did not already exist. And then it has configured this new task as the default build task. The key to making it the default is right here, where it says, is default true? Now let's go back to the TypeScript file here. And the advantage to having a default build task is that I can now use the, in the command palette. So I'll do build. We have tasks run build task. So I can just run the build task very easily right from there. So you can see in the terminal, it is now executing down in the status bar. We can also see a marker, see the output from the build there. So sure enough, there's an error. But the real cool thing is that you can actually use a keyboard shortcut for this. So let me just close this for a second. And the keyboard shortcut, so let's go back here. You can see listed over here, it would be Control Shift B on Windows or Command Shift B on Mac. So if I press that, we can go and kick off a build. And now you can see that it's done the same build as before. So that's the real advantage of having a default build task. You can use that command or the keyboard shortcut to kick off a build very easily. So again, you can configure pretty much anything to be run by the default build task. You can either use one of the automatically generated tasks, such as running TSE uh, build or NPM, one of the NPM scripts, for example, or you can go and configure a new task that would run something on the command line. So there's a lot of options there. So that's a quick look at default build tasks in VS Code.